Welcome Jan and Richard Smith to Parties Extra. We are at the Oklahomans Video Studio to talk about the Oklahoma Artist Invitational event at North Park Mall. Jan is president of the OAI and Dr. Richard Smith is Mercy Neuroscience Institute Medical Director. Welcome you all. Thank you. Thank, Thank you, you very much. And as Dave Moore said, it's our birthday edition because it's both of your birthdays. So happy birthday <laughs> to you. both of you Thank on you. this day. Thank you. Thank you. Same yes. day. You're that that yes. is amazing, yeah. you all. Yeah. Well, it thanks is. for coming thank in. You. Thank you. Well, Jane, you're such a fine artist. You're well, thank you. really a good artist. Uh -huh. And I think you and your artist friends started this wonderful um, art show. Yes, right. So tell us how it really got started. Well, um, in 2010, there were several of us that got together. Um, we were just all artists, and we were just uh, looking at each other's artwork, and we said, someone said, we ought to have an art show. And um, so uh, somebody else said, well, we don't have a venue, though. So I said, well, let me check with my husband, who's the medical director of the Neuroscience Institute over there. I said, that wonderful neuroscience building is built like the Louvre in Paris, so it surely uh, would be a great place. Wonderful to, light. Wonderful light. Mm -hmm. So uh, they okayed it. They were thrilled to have us, and so that's how we began. So then it, uh, we just began with an, it was an afternoon of art. And then it was very popular um, with people. In fact, our very first show, people, uh, the patrons that came in would say, oh my gosh, this is as, as great as the arts festival, mm -hmm. which of course we were most flattered. So, <laughs> so you made it a three day event. <laughs> right. So and now it ended up a being a three day event. <laughs> yes. But I mean, you have a lot of artists. Yes, right. And right. they have a lot of work that they show. Is that right? Yes, yes. we have uh -huh. a, a broad range of work. It's 25 artists. Uh, they are all Oklahoma artists. Um, they are all juried in, so they have to be, they have to submit their artwork, and um, we choose the very best of those because that's what our patrons expect. Mm -hmm. they, they come to our show, they expect and see good artwork, so. Mm -hmm. Well, uh, so how many items do they bring? One or two or three? Oh, they or? bring, um, uh, each of them has a, an area that they are, they show their artwork in, mm -hmm. and um, so they can fill up that space with uh, large paintings if they want or small, so it depends. There's, oh, I'd probably say there's uh, oh, uh, three to 400 items that are offered. And then there's, uh, besides artwork, we have, um, and, and the artwork will come in either oil painting, the mediums will be oil painting or acrylic, uh, we do, we love uh, watercolor and the other things, but we just don't have room for that. Mm -hmm, so mm -hmm. it's just uh, oil and acrylic. But we also have beautiful jewelry. Uh, I've got on a piece of Destin Buckley's uh, handmade. Fabulous. Uh, fabulous. She uses semi-precious stones. Um, and her daughter does wonderful art uh, jewelry work too. And then uh, uh, Judy Osborne from uh, Norman does earrings, you know, that are just, and silver and wonderful. Uh, she uses stones, beautiful stones too. So, um, and then we have uh, Glenn Thomas, who is our sculptor, and he does wonderful work. So, well, Jane, you're you're not at the institute anymore. You're where'd you all right. move? Uh, North Park Mall invited mm -hmm. us to come over and show. Uh, in their mall, uh, they have a wonderful uh, lease space that is where the old Jerome's used to be, mm -hmm. right across from Rococo's. So it's a wonderful venue for us because um, once it's all hung, it looks like a wonderful art gallery. Wow. <laughs> so so that yes. is perfect. It is perfect. And of course, um, both places have easy parking and, and all of that, and they're convenient. But this is so so nice um, it just it just looks like an art gallery who are your artists um, we have uh, 25 artists um, I'll just tell you their names uh, the the Buckley's Dustin and Emily Buckley mm -hmm. uh, so uh, Dr. Buckley and then her daughter are our jewelry artists then we've got Margaret Carroll Henry Close uh, Yvonne Covey T. 
Carrie Cunningham, Barbara Flutie, Debbie Flynn, and Debbie is a new artist. Um, so you have a new artist every year? We try to get a new artist every year. Um, this is, the, we have uh, about 40 juried artists now, but we, uh, and we only have space for 25 artists, mm -hmm. but we still try to get in a new one each time if we can, just to, just to keep it fresh. We have Diane Goldsmith, uh, Margaret Hogue, Jean Kleinsmith, who I'll just have to mention, Jean is in her uh, middle 90s and still painting and is just a brilliant, wonderful woman. Uh, Linda Littlechild, uh, Peggy Lundy, Judy Osborne, who I mentioned, uh, Allison Powers, and Bert Seaborn, who many of you know, mm -hmm. uh, Most, a yeah. very popular Oklahoma artist. Um, then we have three members of the Cycle family. Uh, Karen Cycle is, uh, she and I co-chair the event together. And then Steve and Jesse, uh, uh, Steve's the husband, and then Jesse's the daughter. Jesse and Steve and I all started painting together and were in the very first show. Oh, wow. So that's just mm -hmm. fun. We're, we're the only three fact. that have been consecutively in each in, of the uh -huh. 15 shows. And then we have Polly Sharp, um, Kay Smith, uh, Glenn Thomas, our sculpture, Sandy Wallace, and then um, we had Jason Wilson, but uh, who's a wonderful artist, but um, he's had a, a car accident, so oh. he's not going to be able to be in the show. But So it's a super show. And you have a VIP reception, so tell yes. us about that. I uh, guess the uh, VIP reception is uh, a fairly new uh, event for us. Uh, we have wonderful sponsors, and um, our, our sponsors, our art show, we don't make any money for the art show itself, but to pay, you know, for the printing and all the advertising, mm -hmm. everything that goes on to run an art show, um, we need sponsors. So our community sponsors are, uh, Quail Creek Bank has always been wonderful to sponsor mm -hmm. us. They've just, they're such a community-oriented bank. And then North Park Mall, of course, mm -hmm. another community-oriented people. Um, Barbara Lay, a CPA, is, loves the arts, loves Oklahoma. And, um, then we've got uh, Amshot is a, um, what would you call that, uh, how, what's their, <laughs> How do you they're, describe they're, their business? But yeah, they, they develop online uh, computer pro, uh, pro com mm. computers, what I'm trying to say. Mm -hmm. uh, for instance, they've been very supportive in our uh, effort in digitizing the show right. for advertisements and communication. They've been extremely helpful, right. great to work with. They, they created a fabulous website for us. Um, just and just gave it to us, so it is wonderful. So if anyone wants to look us up on our website, what is it? it is O A I. That stands for Oklahoma Artist Invitational. Mm -hmm. So O A I Art Show dot com. So <laughs> that's yeah, it. It's a fantastic mm -hmm. website. They just did a wonderful oh, job. Oh yeah. Good. So you can find out everything you need to know from that wonderful website. And then we have uh, Mercedes Benz of Oklahoma City has been very gracious. Um, and then um, U.S. Foods and uh, Ben E. Keith, uh, food wholesalers. So they have both, they contribute food. And then, oh, our, our merchants uh, in town are wonderful too. We've got um, uh, Rococo's across the way, they send over food for our VIP party, How you know. Nice. <laughs> right. so. And that VIP party, uh, they can pre-purchase art? Yes. Mm -hmm. uh, for the VIP party, the sponsors uh, are all invited to that. Mm -hmm. uh, and then anyone else who wants to come, they can purchase one of these, uh, it's called a um, certificate of art mm -hmm. purchase. And uh, you can you can purchase them for any amount. Um, and uh, from $25 to $500 if you want, but you uh, you pre-purchase this, then you bring it to the show, mm -hmm. and then you just use this like uh, cash uh, or a gift certificate type of thing. And you have thing. special treats for your 
Yes. Your uh, yes. VIP people. A, VIP people and sponsors. If you're a VIP purchaser, if you bought one of these for $100 or over, then uh, we have a featured artist this year, Steve Seichel. Mm -hmm. And you will receive one of these uh, wonderful prints. This is of the Will Rogers Theater. And he, he just did a great job with this. Um, uh, he researched it and Notorious was the Alfred Hitchcock film that was the very first film they showed there. So of course he did it in these, uh, you know, uh, exciting colors of suspense and it's all, you know. It's very good. It's <laughs> so good, good each, print. Each Mm -hmm. Pers each VIP person uh, will receive one of these free, and the value is $100, so That's awesome. you've, you've come out winning, and then you can still spend your $100 on art or jewelry or sculpture. So, so and the, the whole thing uh, benefits mm -hmm. you all over at Mercy. Benefits yes. the Mercy Foundation. That's the foundation. That's okay. correct, Mercy Health Foundation, uh, benefiting uh, the Comprehensive Stroke Program, which we are at Mercy, mm -hmm. and the Parkinson's Movement Disorder Program. And mm -hmm. and at that time, I mean, you give a talk on all yes. of that. So give us a little yes. preview yeah. about your right. talk. During the show. During the show. <laughs> During two, the art show. Two o'clock on Sunday, the uh -huh. 17th, uh -huh. uh, I have a PowerPoint presentation that deals with the 2019, the latest update on stroke prevention and stroke treatment. Mercy is a comprehensive stroke center. We were the first in Oklahoma. Very prestigious, very difficult thing to achieve, a Joint Commission certified comprehensive stroke center. We were the first in, Oklahoma, first in Oklahoma City, first in Oklahoma, and second in the nation as far as uh, wow. community hospitals go. Most are academic centers, mm -hmm. but Mercy is very unique. So we've had this program, and we started it 18 years ago when there was no, basically, very little available treatment for stroke and now with what we can do we have four neuro hospitalists that only do with stroke and various brain problems wow. eight highly trained stroke nurses as we call them mm -hmm. uh, we have four interventional radiologists so we have 24 7 uh, coverage of any type of stroke problem midnight 2 a.m. 8 a.m. in the morning it's round the clock we have somebody in-house that begins the process, a whole team. We're, we have a very unique team. And our success has been phenomenal. 57% of our patients that we get to in time make a functional recovery. It's really amazing. That is fabulous. It is fabulous. Mm -hmm. And the proceeds from, from a percentage of the proceeds from this, the show mm -hmm. go to the Mercy Health Foundation. And over the years, we've made a very sizable contr contribution to the stroke program and now the movement disorder program. And next week, uh, next Thursday, the uh, 14th of uh, November, we're opening the Herman Mi Mercy Herman Minders um, uh, Movement Disorder Center. Mm -hmm. uh, Herman, Mr. Minders has been extremely generous mm -hmm. to the program and to the Neuroscience Institute at Mercy, and it's really made a huge difference. This is going to be a, another landmark um, uh, facility at Mercy, all contributing to uh, the better neuro health care of all Oklahomans. Well, right. you, you've made a major <laughs> contribution there yourself. Uh, so just tell us a little about your speech. Yeah, the speech uh, is a PowerPoint presentation, about uh -huh. 40 minutes. Mm -hmm. and um, So you're going to tell everyone what to look for. Exactly. We talk about stroke prevention. That's the best treatment, stroke prevention. And then um, uh, we then talk about what can we do if a person has a stroke. The main thing about stroke is it's a, it's a time. Time is brain. The sooner we can get to the individual that has had symptoms onset of a stroke, the better they're going to mm -hmm. do treatment-wise. We go four and a half hours for the intravenous uh, clot dissolving drug. Or we can go actually way up into the uh, 14, maybe as much as 24 hours for very specific strokes. We still have a window that that's, that's that wide on stroke treatment. In the wow. past, it's been three hours, and if you didn't make it, then at that time, you just were out of luck. Now we can go way up because of some very specialized uh, neurodiagnostic equipment we have at Mercy that really helps us. That is and, awesome. Uh, tell them about the videos that they get to see. Oh, yeah. Because the, yeah, the, <laughs> these, uh, these are exciting yeah, to see. Yeah, uh, we do have, on the, on the presentation, <laughs> I have various videos of actually how we extract the, the uh, blood clot from the vessels of the brain itself. It's sort of like a... You know, a heart cath, you get a stent while well, we put the catheter in the brain 
and in the tiny vessels of the brain and extract the clot mechanically. When the clot dissolver doesn't work, which it, it works about 75-80% of the time, but there's about 25%, 20% that have to have the clot extracted mechanically. I bet you have a fascinated crowd, you all. I can just yeah. see. I mean, oh, yeah, I get, this oh, is. Right. I mean, they're all just going. Oh, yeah. right. I get, Everybody mm -hmm. wants to know. I that. get very passionate about right. it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And, and then the, don't you hand out the uh, little cards telling oh, yeah, them about yeah. them? Yeah, it's be fast. Uh, mm -hmm. Anytime a person has severe uh, uh, dizziness, balance issues, eye trouble, double vision, um, some other signs that we look for, facial weakness. Uh, arm weakness, loss of speech or impaired speech, and time, time, do not wait. Get right, right to the Mercy right. Hospital emergency room. Mm -hmm. If you go to the heart hospital, mm -hmm. they put you on a gurney, put you in the tunnel, send you over to us. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. it's, uh, it's time critical. All right, so you want to go to the Mercy, Mercy Emergency, emergency Room, that's room. Right. Mm -hmm. and just say, I'm having a stroke, and bang, off you go. <laughs> yeah. But so uh, the, the, the art show has been, been very mm -hmm. supportive. Over the years, mm -hmm. about $30,000 worth have been contributed mm -hmm. as a percentage of the sales to the Mercy Health right. Foundation. Oh, the, oh, so the, the, art the artists themselves, uh -huh. when we first started in 2010, we said, we, if we're going to have an art show and we'll have people come in and they'll want to see this great art, let's, let's be different than just a regular art show. So let's choose a charity. And so we chose uh, the, the stroke at the Neuroscience mm -hmm. Institute. And then let's do something to educate the public on health education. So, and so I said, well, let me see if I can just, ask Richard uh, if he uh, would yeah. do something. And so he has ever since then. So, so it, it just all kind of fit together. It, it, it just did, fit yeah. together mm -hmm. just beautifully. Just but $30,000 is a lot. It's a lot of yeah. money over, it, over it, the It really has. So, our, And our artists are thrilled to be a part of this, to um, help send those nurses to uh, the educational seminars that they mm -hmm. need for the latest updates and things. So it's, it's, it's it just all works. It's, yeah, it's, it's a yeah. constantly changing mm -hmm. environment for stroke treatment. It gets mm -hmm. better and better. Right. Almost month right. by month. Is that right? Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. it's, there's a, it advances that are just mm -hmm. incredible. That's but it takes a team to do this and mm -hmm. Mercy has been so supportive of a very large team that mm -hmm. it takes one doctor one nurse can't do this it takes a whole team of individuals to provide the treatment that we can provide wow. it's yeah. really amazing anyway mm -hmm. i get all excited about <laughs> it, but the, uh, it all but it just fits yeah. together yeah it does like and, and, and jan's uh, concept mm -hmm. of having the show and then we decided for the community service mm -hmm. that fits right into mercy's uh, mission mm -hmm. and it fits into the, the, the uh, mission of the uh, art show as well mm -hmm. all right. that's awesome do you all have volunteers that help or? We do. We have, um, uh, well, another unique thing about our art show is that all of the artists, we don't have any paid people that work for us. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's just <Yeah>. us. <laughs> so, so we all, everyone in the art show, you know, someone's in charge of advertising, uh -huh. someone's in charge of printing, mm -hmm. you know, this, it just all works out. So uh, everybody works together. And then we offer the opportunity for our um uh, honor students at the high schools mm -hmm. to uh, get some of their volunteer hours through us. So, oh, well, um, that's good too. So that, that, uh -huh. that's that been a good um, help. So. Do, you, do you buy tickets to the show? No, it's free to the public. Free to the public. Free, free to the public. So. Just come in and buy a lot. Just come in, <laughs> yes. Well, come, right. come and look and if you see something you like, obviously purchase it. <laughs> right. And another concept we had at the very beginning was let's um, Let's offer a whole a range, price range of art for people. Mm -hmm. So there's, of course, the wonderful uh, original oils that are, you know, going to be anywhere from just depending on size, say 300 up to 3,000, mm -hmm. you know. Mm -hmm. um, but let's also or offer like prints, like mm -hmm. these uh, on paper. Uh, we offer giclées, which are prints. It's a digital scan of the original artwork, and then it's printed on canvas, and it looks just like the oil painting, and at a much reduced price. That's good. Too. Then there's uh, little note cards, uh, so you could get a say a note card of this, mm -hmm. you know, and um, so that's. Those are only eight dollars and fifty cents. So, so anyone you got any could range. buy uh -huh. yes. any mm -hmm. any price range. If you like it, there's something that you could purchase there. Jan, what are your hours? 
the hours are um, and do the date give the, the date. dates. Mm -hmm. oh, yes, okay, <laughs> <That's> important thing. <laughs> All right, we know it's at North Park Mall, mm -hmm. uh, November fifteenth, sixteenth, and seventeenth. Mm -hmm. On that Friday, uh, the VIP party um, is from uh, three thirty to four. Mm -hmm. Then open to general admission uh, or public is um, from four to eight. Mm -hmm. Then on Saturday and Sunday, it's from 11 till 5.30. Both days? Both days, both okay. days, right. Okay. And the other thing we have um, are four marvelous raffles that are, uh, th these are exciting. We offer those, uh, um, they're $5 a ticket or you can get five tickets for $20. Mm -hmm. And we've got four raffles. Um, the, uh, most valuable raffle is a Glenn Thomas sculpture and it's valued between four and five hundred dollars. Mm -hmm. Then uh, there's an uh, offer of uh, a larger print of this uh, Will Rogers Hotel, I mean uh, <laughs> theater, uh, that's valued at two hundred and with that um, a friend in the village has given us a hundred dollar gift certificate to have it framed so yeah. that's one mm -hmm. another raffle then Dustin Buckley she will she will give us a, a pendant with a gemstone in it of some type and uh, along with that uh, BC Clarks has given us an Austin picture by Reed and Barton and then Rococo's has given us a gift card so those are lumped together and then the fourth one is uh, Vera Bradley purse and Shelley's aesthetics. Um, uh, it's a $50 gift certificate, gift certificate for dermabrasion. Mm -hmm. And uh, along with that, uh, Big Sky Bread has given uh, six months of uh, free loaf of bread each month. So, well, and that's a good deal. Oh, that, <laughs> that is, oh, they're yeah, fantastic. Right. <laughs> Put in for that. Yeah, one. <laughs> and a hundred percent of those ra uh, the raffles go mm -hmm. to um, Stroke and Parkinson's. Oh, so, you all, that's fabulous. Yeah, that's just fabulous. It's, it's, it's really great. fun. Well, it's the art is beautiful. Everyone will just enjoy being there. It's just a very pleasant atmosphere, very pleasant way to spend the uh, afternoon or evening and uh, then you can give to the community, uh, give to a wonderful event uh, besides enjoying yourself. Well, okay. Anything else about strokes? No, I can, well, I can go on and on, but how much time do we have? I, I, I could get into great, make it really granular if you want. But no, that, that gives the overall view. Mm -hmm. Two o'clock uh, Sunday mm -hmm. afternoon right. in the show. We have a little area. Yeah. Yeah. We have a, a little mm -hmm. private area where we give the talk. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So it's then for, it's time for questions and all that sort of thing after the, after the presentation. Okay. okay, anything else about the show? I think that probably covers it. So everyone come, yeah. you, you'll guaranteed to enjoy it. Mm -hmm. Oh, and, and there, oh, well, there is, there are refreshments. Uh -huh. <laughs> so, th and that's always good, yes. really good, so. Perfect, well, right. thanks Jan and Richard yes. for helping promote art and health. <laughs> a great combination and for starting such a fine show. We are fortunate to have such a great community awareness for preventing strokes. Hope you all have lots of people come out for your event and that they buy lots of paintings. All right, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.